all the world is looking to develop solutions for a sustainable future. Meanwhile, the heavy vehicle industry is moving ahead in leaps and bounds. Many people think that hybrid and fully electric vehicles are the technology of the future. The exhibitors at the Brisbane Truck Show demonstrate that much of the technology is available here and now. The first manufacturer made production model e-canter electronic truck here in Australia. Sea Electric is an Australian company specialising in the assembly and electrification of 100% electric commercial vehicles around the world. This segment is huge and growing substantially. Sea Drive can be fitted to the end user's preferred OEM cab chassis. One of the most exciting developments comes from key component suppliers who have released products designed to facilitate the transition to electric vehicles. This is particularly important because heavy vehicles are typically customised far more than their light vehicle counterparts. A really interesting uh, challenge for OEMs in this particular space in terms of transitioning their businesses from uh, what are traditionally internal combustion engine manufacturing businesses and now into EV. And this vehicle represents the start of that journey for us. Deliveries in inner cities and so on is really what this vehicle is aimed at. Heavy vehicle operators are used to adjusting the specifications of their vehicles to meet the needs of their businesses. Dana, Meritor and Eaton all had key drivetrain components on prominent display. As well as electrification, uh, which is the new wave that we see happening in, in the commercial vehicle market in the not too distant future. The commitment of key suppliers to providing electric drivetrain options to their customers shows our industry's commitment to supporting operators who make the choice to electrify their fleet. Meritor is a leader in axle drivetrain products globally. So the Blue Horizon brand is a sector of our business that really addresses the emerging trends, really positioning the business for the electrification side of, of the industry. We have to supply a product that we can support from start to finish. The worst thing that we could do is to introduce this really good technology into the market and we not be able to support it for such a basic thing such as, say, a battery or something like that. The heavy vehicle industry is preparing for the growth in its use and application. It's going to be very different to the way that EV technology is applied. That being said, this light duty market that we're representing at the moment is probably the most critical and most pertinent starting point because that is where a lot of this type of technology really matters. We are all excited to see the future, to be part of the generation that is going to change the way we travel. While you might look around here and think the industry is yet to face these challenges, the changes are already happening right under your feet. The product that we're launching here today is the e-axle platform under that Blue Horizon brand. The economics make sense now, the duty cycle works, uh, the weight uh, limitations or impact on payload are negligible. So there's 22 contracts with OEMs across the globe and under those contracts we deliver up to 130 vehicles on the road by the end of 2020. If you think about the vehicle, silent operation, so it lends itself to running in urban environments. Uh, so the time is right for this particular segment to transition to 100% EV and I've no doubt in two years time when we're back here again that we're going to see a much greater range of electric vehicles uh, in the um, delivery and distribution vehicle space in particular. While everyone is waiting for the revolution, the revolution has already started here at the Brisbane Truck Show.